Hey everybody, Sagittarius 98 Adam here, and I decided that I'm going to do a test map of Maryland. So in just under a week for the GeoGuessr League, I'll be playing a Maryland seed. And I realized the last time I played Maryland was when I did the Old Iron Excursion series, which ended July 4th. And that was even that was even a Baltimore map. So move back one week earlier. So June. Last time I played Maryland was in June. Now I'll be playing Maryland again as my home map. Not too worried, but I decided I might as well test it out. I have some time now, so I'm going to record it. I'm actually not going to be able to record the League episode. That's probably the only League episode that I won't be able to record. Possibly some when we get into um, the second round. Um, when I'm back home for, for winter break, I might not be able to record either for some of the days. But now I'm available. Um, Except that one day. So I'm going to record Maryland now. Just a practice game. Four minutes, which I suppose is what I'm going to have for the home app. Perhaps it will be less. Um, and I see the uh, loading issues from yesterday are still persisting. Um, it also just froze, which is not good. There we go. But still not loading. I have no idea what the, the issue with that is. Hopefully I can move like this, or not, maybe, sort of, yes, kind of, I mean, yeah, it's moving, okay, I mean, I'll, I'll take this, we're on a small road, probably on the eastern shore, although I can't really tell, uh, no, I'm going to say this is more Central Maryland than Eastern Shore. Of course, I'm, there's an intersection out there. I'm pretty limited in what I can see because, well, I'm moving and there's... Uh, you know, I can barely see anything because of this, this whole movement thing. Or not movement, but the, the loading issues. So, yeah, definitely it kind of looks like it could be Central Maryland. Some are maybe Frederick Carroll counties. Um, is what my guess would be. Maybe Howard County, also a good possibility. Even Baltimore County, northern Baltimore County is a possibility out towards Hartford and Cecil. So, you know, I basically named half of the possible uh, counties in Maryland. Not exactly, but a fourth. But it's in, it's in this area somewhere. I might as well put down a pin um, before I run out of time because it's taking two minutes to go about 30 meters. This loading issue really needs to, to fix. I'm not sure, honestly, I'm not sure if I'm going to, well, for one, if I'm going to continue with this video because I don't think it's very enjoyable to watch. I'm basically just recording audio because there's no not much video to record in this. Maybe now? I mean, I'm going to, I'm moving a little bit. Like I, I moved past that barn. Right, I'm still only about 200 meters from the start. There's an intersection right there, so I might as well uh, go up to there. Yep, there it is, stop sign. What's at the stop sign? It is Oakland Road, which is also 304, which is on the Eastern Shore. So I was right initially. It is Eastern Shore 304. Nope, that's 404. I think 304 is also on the Eastern Shore. I think you have the road that goes through Rehoboth um, from Easton-ish. That's 404. So I'm going to put my marker there for now. 304, 328, 404. Is there 304 goes through Centerville? So we're there going up to Goldsboro. I've taken this road, I think. So that's 304. I was on Oakland and what? Oakland and... Um, And no idea. There it is. <laughs> Covered up by the stop sign. There. Oakland and Bridgetown. Bridgetown. There's Bridgetown. Or did we cross Cox Sawmill? Uh, we did turn. Turn number two. So that would put us like right there. We didn't move very far because of the bad movement, right? So that was probably turn one. And this was a star, obviously, it's not going to um, load in time. So I, I'm wherever I put it, 
it's good, close enough. Should be within 30 or 40 points. Um, and we'll see. Nope. Within 300 points, because apparently Bridgetown Road does some sort of U shape. We'll find out soon enough once the map loads how uh, that works. Okay. I really need to, uh, hold on. Okay, did it load yet? There we go. Oh yeah, okay, I see that. Bridgetown Road is also here. That makes sense, I should have looked at the compass. I'll take that, I mean that's not, it's not ideal. What's also an ideal is blurry cameras. This looks to be Western Maryland somewhere. And who knows where. Probably Garrett County. Could also be Allegheny County. Um, one of those two. I don't think this is Washington County, although it still could be, but I feel the mountains are a little too tall, a little too Appalachian in appearance. Is this US 40? It's a backbone mountain, which is US 50. That's the highest point in Maryland. Backbone mountain, which stretches from here, because that's the trail access, which is in West Virginia. Trail access, that's the trail. Backbone Mountain Trailhead. This is the summit of Backbone Mountain. This is right here. Hoy Crest. So that means we're here. Right now, we're here, which means we started over there. There's an elementary school or something right here, right at... It's probably not an elementary school. No, it's like a bar, which is this. It's Backbone Mountain Pizza. Table Rock Inn. So I started over somewhere here in... I went west in a little curve, and then right. That's that road. Yep. Yeah, so I'm I'm facing Calico Calico Road. Um, that's good enough. Uh, no, it's not. We were further. Okay. One star blurry camera. I another blurry camera. I shouldn't be too, too surprised. And we're moving backwards. Now when I try to move forwards, it's moving at one frame per click. Okay, I'm not going that direction then. Let's try this direction. Good camera. It's Route 258, which is somewhere. <laughs> I have no idea where 258 is. Crossing a river. What is this river? Rockhold Creek. No idea. Eastern Shore, though. There's a sit-go. Other gas stations are available. Um, that would be a good sign to read. Come on. It froze, which is why it's not. Ugh. I tightened the cable on the router, which I think helped in the last round, because it was moving decently well. That must be what the issue is. Uh, now, it, now it's just that the, literally the thing froze. Yeah, see, like now it's, it's loading more or less fine. Uh, there is an address there, or, and a town, but I can't read it. This side? Nope, that's blurry. Let's get back to the good camera, okay. There was a sign right here, which says Rockhold Creek and Maryland 256. So 256 and 258. Do I want to look for those? Yes. 256 and 258. Down by uh, Salisbury? Maybe? No, that's a little Cambridge, maybe? Nope, 256 and 258. Um, 282, seems like it'll be more in here, 256. 
Those are mostly the ones. Oh, it could be in here. Yep, 255, 258 to 256, Rockhold Creek Road. So then I started somewhere in here, because this is 258. Going to 256, which is Rockhold Creek Road. I started on Swamp Circle Road. Right. Where? I can't go that way, because it's going to turn me and go backwards. I went this way. I went left, right, left to the intersection. Okay. So that's, that's this business right here. That's the whole left, left thing. So there's one house. Let's say two houses. Two houses up. And then there's a break and another house there. Which is here. There's one house there. I'm going to leave it where it is. Perfect score. One star, of course. Blurry camera. Not blurry camera. It looks like... First of all, have we been here before? Maybe not. It's pretty similar to the location. I'm pretty sure this is going to be... I mean, 301 area code, 240, so... Cutoff is about here, and points west. Really, I think this is going to be either Montgomery or PG County. PG being uh, Prince George's County. And I would say Montgomery County. Like, maybe in the only area. Um, could be only, could be... Like it's in East County, basically. It's East County. If it is Montgomery County, maybe Bethesda, but we're going to find out. Randolph. Yep, Randolph and... Wait, what? Okay, what? Oh, this is a giant. Okay, I know where we are. So we're on New Hampshire Avenue crossing Randolph by the giant. There's a giant gas. So what's this road? It's Midland. Okay, Midland. At the end of Midland. And so now, this, but we went north, and then it was Partridge and Copley. Okay, I get it. We were here by that house, like here. That's going to be good enough for me, 2.2 meters off. And last round, which appears to be probably Montgomery County again. Maybe Frederick. Daisy and Ed Warfield. Okay, 443. So, scratch that idea. Does Carroll County use 443? Maybe. There's also 301. And 443 in the same zone, which is weird, because those don't overlap. I'm guessing it's just 301. So, we're, we're actually in 301, and that 443 is a red herring. Union Chapel, isn't that, that's, that's, there's Union Bridge. Is there a Union Chapel somewhere? No. I mean, maybe there is, but I'm not going to spend too much time looking for it. I'm going to go on Union Chapel. Uh, speed limit 30. Uh, I'll take it. What, hold on, what are the bins? The bins are blue, not a Montgomery County logo. Yeah, I think we're either... We're either in Frederick or could be Frederick, could be Carroll. I don't think we're in Montgomery County. We're probably up up in here somewhere. But the question is exactly where. Four minutes is not a lot of time, as I have realized in the first uh, challenge that I played for the Jury Guesser League, and then this. I'm just hoping that the home maps are always going to be at least four minutes, like because I really don't want a one-minute Maryland map. That would be uh, that would be really bad, uh, to say the least. Uh, Bell Haven from the low 600s, which means a house like that from the low 600s means that we're in not Montgomery County. That that that's ruled out already. Those are those kinds of signs I've seen in Howard County. This could be Howard County. Somewhere in the northern portion, because the houses are pretty cheap. Now, I realize 600000 for a house. If you're from Texas, that's like, you'd probably buy a, like, 
25 acres for that money, but in Maryland, you can't. Especially not, I mean, in Montgomery County, 600,000 will get you, will get you a freestanding house in a, in a suburban neighborhood. Townhouse, 350, 400,000 for a townhouse, 600,000, you might be able to get a single family home. But houses like that, you're going to pay easily over, um, easily over, over 800 up to a million dollars probably for a house like that in Montgomery County. Hunt Valley Drive. Hunt Valley is in Baltimore County. There's Hunt Valley. Is there Union Creek somewhere? Or is that a red herring? This could be uh, Baltimore County. There's a stop sign. Stop sign says Union Chapel, Route 97, Howard County. Here we go. 97, Union Chapel, Ed Warfield, Daisy. And we started on this road, which was, we went the other way. We went east. East, well, we can figure this out. East, so we were on Ed Warfield, right? That has to be the case. We had to have been here, and then we went Union Chapel, right. The question is where, is that already, that's the, that's the intersection. So we were like here, oh, at the, the curve, there. Where's Duval then? I don't see Duval anywhere. That's Duval? That's Duval, okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll buy that. One second left. Off by one point, I'll take that. That is, was Glen Elg, Annapolis. Yeah, that's, that's Howard County. Because Carroll, yep, that's all. Howard continues in through here. Matt Airy is already uh, Carroll County. Newmarket is Frederick County. This is all Howard, which makes sense. This is definitely out in the, it's pretty far from Baltimore, um, in the sense that it's like 45 minutes, I would say. Maybe a little less, actually. <laughs> but Baltimore is not as big of a, a commuting destination as D.C. is, so makes sense why it was a little cheaper. It's a little out, out in the, the middle of nowhere. Which makes sense, those, those 600,000 house prices. Yeah, so 629, I don't really know why I show the full results. I mean, I guess you can see the, the distances. Not the greatest start. Um, finally figured out what the issue was with the loading. So if that happens next time, I'm going to gonna adjust the, the router again. Um, but overall, a, a pretty decent game. A good spread. One Eastern Shore location, three in... I mean, you had, that's in Arundel, PG, or not PG, Montgomery, in Arundel, Howard, Garrett, and then whatever this county is. I'm not good with my Eastern Shore counties. I can name all of them, but I don't really know where they're located. That might be Kent County, Kent, uh, Caroline County, I think, is what this is. It's either Kent or whatever. No one cares, probably, who's watching this, unless you're from Maryland. But, anyway, I know it's practice seed. And so I'm feeling pretty good for next Wednesday. And until next time. See